हेलो नॉलेज एंथोरियस्ट वेलकम टू आवर चैनल द क्रिटिकल रोल ऑफ सर्किट ब्रेकर्स हैव यू एवर वॉन्टेड फॉर प्रोटेक्ट आवर होम्स एंड इंडस्ट्रीज फ्रॉम इलेक्ट्रिकल डिजास्टर्स एट द हार्ट ऑफ आवर इलेक्ट्रिकल सेफ्टी आर सर्किट ब्रेकर्स क्रूसल डिवाइस डिजाइन टू सेफ गार्ड आवर सिस्टम्स these vigilant guardians monitor electrical currents and promptly disconnect power upon detecting any abnormalities this swift action helps avert potential hazards such as fires or extensive equipment damage ensuring our environments remain safe by acting autonomously circuit breakers ensure that threats are mitigated before they can cause any harm so essentially circuit breakers act as a first line of defense in any electrical system how do circuit breakers work now let's dive deeper into how these vital components work Imagine a circuit breaker as a highly attentive guardian of the electrical world. Its primary role is to monitor the flow of electricity through a circuit. When this guardian detects any abnormal surge or fault in a current akin to sensing a disturbance, it acts swiftly. The circuit breaker interrupts the current flow much like hitting a pause button to prevent potential hazards. Unlike a fuse which once blown must be replaced, A circuit breaker is designed for longevity. It can be reset and reused, making it an efficient and cost-effective solution in our electrical systems. Each type of circuit breaker, be it air break, air blast, oil, or SF6, employs a unique method to extinguish the electrical arcs that occur during faults. Air break and air blast breakers. use the air itself to quell the arc while oil and sf6 breakers rely on their respective substances to suppress these electrical faults this rapid response not only saves lives but also minimizes equipment damage ensuring that our electrical systems run smoothly and safely types of circuit breakers and their roles Each type of circuit breaker has a unique role based on its design and the specific needs of the electrical system it protects. Let's begin with air break circuit breakers. These devices are quite common in low voltage situations such as residential and small commercial settings. They operate by creating a break in the air between contacts as they pull apart effectively interrupting the current the simplicity of their design makes them cost effective and easy to maintain moving on to air blast circuit breakers these are a step up in terms of capability they use a high velocity blast of air to extinguish the arc when contacts separate this type is particularly effective for high voltage systems and is appreciated for its rapid operation and the reduced mechanical stress on the breaker components next we have the mema oil circuit breakers these utilize some oil but significantly less than their bulk oil counterparts the oil acts as an arc extinguisher and helps cool the system these breakers are advantageous because they reduce the risk of fire and requires less maintenance than bulk oil circuit breakers speaking of bulk oil circuit breakers these use a large volume of oil as an arc extinguishing medium they are robust and suitable for high fault levels but are larger and requires more maintenance Lastly the SF6 circuit breakers which use sulfur hexafluoride gas to quench the arc 
these are ideal for high voltage applications due to their superior arc quenching properties and are widely used in industrial and utility applications. Understanding these differences helps engineers and technicians choose the right circuit breaker for the right application, optimizing safety and efficiency across countless electrical systems. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe our channel. Till then, goodbye and take care. Thanks for watching.